lot of you have been asking me how to withdraw your rewards from your nodes. So I'm going to show you how to do that really quick. A lot of you said that it can't be done or it's impossible. Research is a scam. They're keeping your crypto coins, your pre-search coins that you're earning. But I kind of call BS on that. Just like I tell everybody in the comments that has that comment, you can withdraw your rewards. Uh, you're totally able to do that. So let me show you how. Here we are on the main pre-search uh, website, presearch.com. You can see up here in, in the uh, the web uh, explorer bar. So go over here, click on this, uh, or just run your mouse over where it says how much pre that you got right now and uh, usage rewards. You'll see a menu here drop down, go to node stakes. So you can see I got 3,121 pre available to stakes. I should be able to withdraw that, right? So let's go over here, re-wallet, click on the pre-wallet. Do you see where I click that pre-wallet right there? So I got lock tokens, 809, be available for withdrawal on uh, 4-17-2028. I have 2,300 I can withdraw, right? So they lock a couple of them up. Uh, you know, they want to give it some time so people just can't dump their tokens on the market. So you got to withdraw tokens. Let's just say I want to withdraw 2312, the wallet address. I'm going to use my MetaMask Ethereum address. So if you got MetaMask installed up here uh, on your, this is Google Chrome. So you need the extension to do that. So click on the wallet address, copied it. I'm going to go down here, paste it. And then we're going to enter 2FA code and we're going to hit withdraw. And it just gives you some terms of service, blah, blah, blah. Hit continue. It'll process and we'll give it a second, see how long it takes. Uh, waiting email confirmation. So let's go check the email. Research sent me email. Just as a request has been made to withdraw 2,312 tokens from presearch.com from this IP address. So hit confirm my withdrawal and you just have to wait for this manual review and your tokens will be withdrawn. That's all you got to do. It's as simple as that. It's like baking a cake. So guys, if you did everything correctly, you should get an email from presearch. And it's basically going to tell you that your withdrawal is now ready for you to process using your Ethereum wallet. Remember, I was using my MetaMask wallet up here on the extension bar. This is Google Chrome that I'm using. So it just basically says in order to process your withdrawal, you'll need to connect your uh, Web3 wallet and submit a transaction to the Ethereum blockchain. Full instructions can be found here. So let's go ahead and connect our wallet. Let's click on this. So here it is. It's ready for withdrawal. Let's make sure I got my wallet on Ethereum, which it is. I got a little bit of ETH in there for gas. You definitely need gas uh, or some Ethereum for gas in your wallet. So make sure you do got a little bit of ETH in there. So when you submit the transaction, uh, you know, gas is going to be paid for. So let's hit connect wallet. You can see uh, once I connected my wallet, which was MetaMask, it basically gives me a message saying you may now complete your withdrawal by connecting Web3 wallet and clicking process withdrawal below. So I'm all connected. I don't want to disconnect. I want to hit confirm withdrawal. And that's the 2300 tokens that I requested the other day. So let's hit withdraw. Give it a second here. Hit process withdrawal. Okay, so gas is $4.93. Like I said, I got about $60 in Ethereum in my MetaMask wallet. That'll pay for the gas. So I'm gonna hit confirm. This is on my Trezor. I always use a hardware wallet for extra protection. I always do. I always recommend it. 
and be careful what sites you link it to. Always check the web address. Make sure it's a legit site. So I just did process the transaction. I had enough gas. It got paid for. If you want to check it, you can go up to your MetaMask. You go to activity right here. And there it is. If you click on that, you can view this on Etherscan. As you can see, there was success. Uh, transaction fee for gas, $4.94. Everything went well. So for all the naysayers that are saying that pre-search is a scam and you can't withdraw your tokens, remember you got to have a minimum of 1,000 tokens. And you also got to submit, uh, you know, to get your withdrawal. Uh, so, you know, you're not going to be able to get it without that. So just follow the same steps I did. It ought to work for you pretty well, I would think. So give it a little bit and you should see your pre-search tokens show up in your wallet. So let's click up here on the wallet. Let's see if it's in there. Let's go to assets. There it is, 2,312 pre-search tokens. That's $184. And I can do whatever I want with that. You know, I can buy some other tokens. I can swap it out, you know, for something else. Whatever I want to do. It's up to you uh, or up to me. <laughs> but uh, you do what you want to with your own tokens, right? Um, but anyway, that's really all I got on that. Just wanted to make a short, small video. I've had a lot of people comment on this, like more than any other comment about pre-search that it was a scam and they couldn't withdraw. So I hope that kind of settled it right there. Um, and if I keep getting these comments, I'm just going to refer you back to this video. Okay. But that's all I got for now. Until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Be sure you like, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. Also come to the uh, Discord, it's very active, trying to grow that. Uh, follow me on Twitter, and I am also now on Rumble, believe it or not. But I appreciate it, thank you.